So, welcome back to the vlog. Um, give me a little rundown of uh, what we're doing today. Um, when we got our fence put in, um, we didn't get this one portion of our yard done, so we bought a bunch of cedar trees to put in a row there to kind of provide some privacy. So today we're undergoing the fun task of doing that. Digging holes. So I'll give you a look at what we're doing. First we have to move these stones somewhere. Move all this stuff. And then move these pieces of wood. And then take that smaller rocks, put them behind there, and then dig holes for eight of these lining up down here. So it's gonna take a little bit. Chuck might help. Let's get started. Hey Chuck. Could you eat a little bit more grass? Oh yeah, good, good, yeah. Can you tell this is where we put all of our junk? All right, so I don't know if you can guess what we're doing. So all that wood over there, um, we're cutting it up so it's smaller, so it can fit in our small little fireplace. But there are like really big pieces, so I'm just gonna like set a fire and get the really big pieces in there so they can slowly burn, because uh, I can't cut them up with the saw because there's too many nails in it and stuff. So let's get a fire started and then get back to cutting, and then maybe we can finally plant these freaking cedars. So that's not working. Oh! Okay, attempt number two. So Chuck had the genius idea one day to not listen to us and proceeded to sniff this fireplace while there was a fire in it. He's never done it again because I'm pretty sure he burnt his nose a little bit. Is that what a fire is supposed to look like? Give me a, uh, get, 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 give me. Give me a Hi. rundown of what you're doing in here. Uh, so this used to be some type of smoker, so there's just a lot of soot and bricks in here. And we're trying to clean it out so we can keep like our firewood in here. And uh, not kind of feel scared to come in here because it is a little bit freaky. 
Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing in here. All right, people. We are making some progress. I should be on an episode of Trading Spaces for how quickly I transformed this back um, weird room. As you can see, uh, we laid some new tile. Um, and now we're just doing a pallet wall up the one side. And we're slowly getting rid of all that wood. And then fire's just roaring. Chuck is just yawning. And yeah. I had this good idea of filming him while he chewed at the water. No chewing, no water. He's he's not interested. He's not interested. Oh. But it did make him thirsty. Okay, so it's been about like an hour and a half since I saw you last. Finally got it cleaned out. Now we're finally breaking ground. Woo! I have eight holes to dig, maybe even more. Shaken feet, your most premium shaken feet. Oh. All right, fast forward about five hours. Um, we finally got it finished. Got all of our stuff done. I'm gonna show you the little, the backyard now. So we also um, mowed the lawn. So here's the backyard. But you guys were saying like, oh, let us see the shed, let us see the cedars. It's like, whoa, hold on guys. So here is that back scary room. So, not so scary anymore. Still a little scary. Got our lawn stuff. Got our firewood. And we're gonna paint this door red to match the rest of the trash. Okay, so Caroline cleaned out this entire shed, um, rearranged it. This is what it looks like now. And let me say, 100% of the things that were in here weren't actually ours. It's just stuff that the previous homeowner left behind. So, pretty annoying. But it's done. So our goal today was to plant these cedars that we bought in the section where we didn't get the fence done and really that only took like 30 minutes of our entire day and we spent the rest of the day doing other stuff we didn't actually plan on doing. But it's fine because now our backyard is like done. Anyways, here are the cedars and a dog butt. So we need one more to go right there. So we're one cedar short of having a perfect backyard. Got the got the seeds down. Get some grass growing. Chuck, could you please get off the grass? There's something in your butt. 
Yeah, it's a flower petal. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I already tried to pick. He has a flower petal in his butthole that he won't let me pick out. <laughs> um, what the oh, heck was that? Oh shit, stuff is going down. What's going on? Oh, here we go. Please watch the trees. Chuck, man. Yeah. Chuck, you're fine. Chuck, come here. Okay. So, for those of you who are like, oh my god, all your dog ever does is sleep. He always just like looks like a cat laying around. He can yell. He can yell. Chuck, man. You're fine. Okay, guys. Thanks for, uh... Come on. Come on. You're fine. Come on. Okay. Okay. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys at the track um, this week. Hopefully I can start running this week. Hopefully. But if not, you'll see me throwing. Holy. Okay. See ya. Thanks for watching. Bye.